Hey guys, so we're just here with a get ready for bedtime video and I am going to be applying a mask and lately I have been using a lot of face products so oh that's really nice smells like rose um so I want to just sort of purify my skin and this is a poor cleansing mask, which is cool. I think it is clay, has clay in it. Um, And I've used clay masks for years now. Um, as you guys probably know by now, I am all for natural sort of beauty and skincare. So yeah. And I want to sort of focus on skin regeneration tonight. So to make the most of the products here, I want to first focus on cleansing the skin. So that we have a really nice base to work with. When it comes to absorption of product. Okay, so now that I've applied that, I'm going to let it sit, put a timer on, and then I'll be back in probably about 15, 20 minutes. Maybe a little sooner depending on how fast this mask absorbs. So play it by ear. Never use this mask actually, it was like a little sample. Um, but it smells really nice. Yeah, okay. I think we're good. So right before this, I actually exfoliated my face with, this is an almond face scrub, and it has almond, crushed almond, um, almost like pulverized with a few other things, and I've used that for years. Really lovely formula. And then an Omori Visca Budapest Thermal Cleansing Balm. It's like an oil. It's a really thick oil. I received this in a kit. It was during the holiday season. And this is the first time I ever used this brand. Um, but it came with a few different of their... Yeah, it was a set. And so this was one of them. And uh, But it's very thick. It's almost like I can't imagine cleaning my face with that. But it's a, yeah, it's a very thick oil. So... Anyhow, um, but I love that, that line and the philosophy that they work with through their products using mineral water. That's very cool. Um, the body can absorb minerals, of course, right? The skin being the largest organ. So, okay. In the meantime, why don't we sort of 
exfoliate the arms here and I'm gonna take my watch off and charge it while we get ready for bed. It is dead, so let's just plug that in. And I'm gonna grab my, oh, okay, so looking ahead for the nighttime, well, we'll get into that in a bit, but um, here we go. This is the one I wanna use, the Herbivore Coco Rose. I'm gonna use this on my forearms and my hands. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's take a little bit like this. Put on my hands and I'm just going to sort of scrub. I love scrubs for increasing circulation flow in the body. Figure a while we're waiting for the face to sort of mask <laughs> and dry up. I sort of just tend to another part of the vessel. Getting back in touch with the physical body, acknowledging the physical body can be very helpful in grounding. It's very important. So this is reminding me of Korea. <laughs> when I was in Korea, it was some time ago when I was in Japan, I decided right before that I, you know, I would leave to go back to the States. Um, I was like, you know, let me go visit Korea. I've always dreamt of Korea. And, you know, of course they're famous for their skincare etiquette and so on. And their history there with that is extensive. So it's very interesting because I tried out like one day one time I decided to try, I got like, I had some coupon thing. It was on like a local tour app. Anyways, it was for like a body scrub session. Very interesting. <laughs> so yeah, um, very cool, very cool experience. Um, that's again, one of my passions. I hope one day to be able to travel and focus on health and skincare as it is carried out around the world and from this perspective of um, the discussion around, you know, the topic of eco-friendly green and also seeing the body as a gateway and a portal to the whole vessel, right? My, you know, the spiritual entity as well in our essence um, as bringing attention to the physical body may help reunite that space of consciousness um, of what it means to be human and what it you know the human being and the emotional being so and also you know focusing on the body as a means of also support and empowerment. And when we focus on our physical body and strengthening that, that's a medium, that's a tool for us to find a, an experience that is, I think, intensely gratifying, intensely gratifying and empowering and um, surprisingly fun as well. So, I feel so soft right now. <laughs> so smooth. Wow, I haven't done a scrub in such a long time. That was really nice. I did that on mostly dry skin, so it was a very, very nice scrub scrub. And I'm just feeling so luxurious right now. It leaves this beautiful little satiny finish. Um, I, yeah, I just really love that formula. And the smell of the rose in that is just so particular. But anyways, we've got a rose theme going on here tonight. But yes, going back to what we're saying, um, yeah, um, you know, because the skin specifically is, you know, I think it's interesting because beauty and skin care is not, I find, you know, there's so much more to it. It connects also to your health. And so focusing on even so-called symptoms that we may find on the physical body are usually indicators of what is happening inside the body. 
usually, again, what is happening on the outside of the body is usually an indicator of what's happening inside the body. So I find that it's very, yeah. So usually what comes up on the outside of the body is an indicator of what is happening on the inside of the body. So taking a holistic approach, yeah, it's very interesting, but also looking at the skin as the major detox pathway. So that's very cool. And that's something I like to focus on. So I think I'm pretty much, I'm good with the mask. So let's remove it. I'm going to actually do that with another cotton round and these are reusable, it's face halos. People just have been, I don't know why my finger is hurting a little bit. <laughs> kind of weird. Um, all right, let's. Also very impressed with the face halo. This is absorbing a lot of products and it's just holding on to it. So I'm gonna throw these in the wash and we'll be clean hopefully. Ideally, I would wipe my face down with the beauty water or at least a filtered water from the water ionizer filtration system that I have by Enagic, and I'll put the link down below in the bio box um, for that. I've been using that for about years now, and uh, it's really a wonderful sort of uh, contraption. Um, I was trying to get it hooked up to my sink for some time, and finally I got it hooked up. And it has a water on there that is uh, made for your skin specifically, pH-wise. So it's cool. Um, again, I'll link that in the bio box below. Let's get back to the skin and sort of get a mask going. But before we do, let's just take a moment to enjoy <laughs> how soft my skin feels right now. Wow. It's such a beautiful, beautiful clay. Let's go over here. Back over here and we're one of these masks. Now I'm looking for more of a nourishing mask. And um, I think what I'll do is maybe I'll even go with something that you can actually leave on your face. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Um, and the one thing though that I'd like to do is put on also these little eye masks so but I'm gonna go in with my May Lindstrom skin brush and I'm just going to take some of this this is Omar Visca again same brand as that thermal oil we talked about earlier this is again the line is from Budapest and they use minerals inside of their bombs which is really cool this is a gold hydra lifting mask so i'm just going to take some of this and I need to see myself to do this <laughs> i'm just going to sort of brush it on my skin Go down the neck. I was watching a YouTube video and the lady said to apply your skincare also to your ears. Which was interesting. Nice reminder to not forget all parts of the body, of course. Again, that's why I love skincare because it brings you to focus on how you connect with yourself. So it's a lovely exercise. Let's go back to the kitchen and gonna do is just to seal that in let it sit and now I'm going to get ready for bed put a few spritzes of this 
I'm gonna put that over my arms where we had the scrub. can be a great space for your self-care routine. So I'm gonna put that back. The smell is just heavenly. And you know what? I think I'm gonna give some attention to my cuticles as well. I'm using this little salve. It's an herbal remedies peppermint healing salve. A little bit of this. Apply it to the goals. to remember that everything is related to something else in the body and that it's all just so connected. Wow. Right now. So I think we're good. Um, I'm gonna head to bed now. Before I do, I'm gonna drink water and um, I'll catch you guys in the next videos. Bye.